I am proud to have been a part of the studentship of the University of Copenhagen. And this I'm going to carry with me until it deteriorates by itself. I used to work in the pathology department where I was in charge of the cytology unit. I was so much into children because sometimes their tumors are so bizarre and it's heartbreaking to see them. And then there was this uh, Danida scholarship that is related to malaria research. And so there's this cancer that was common among the children. It was one of the cancer that killed them the most. And it's associated with malaria, which is the Beckett, endemic Beckett lymphoma. And so I decided that, that that is an opportunity for me to do a study in it, to be able to help the children. Hey, Cecilia, let's go to, to my office and have a look at these results so we can see what, what has happened. I mean, yes, I'm yeah. collaborating with Lars Vid, who is my main supervisor. And um, he is m much interested in malaria. And so Hello. we are looking at the role of malaria in the pathogenesis of the disease. Our research might lead to a better way of diagnosing the disease and then it might lead to um, a form of treatment. Both my supervisors back here in Ghana and then in Denmark, Dr. Michael Fori in Ghana, getting what it takes for me to get the samples, he has been so helpful. And when I went to Denmark, my supervisor in Denmark last has been so helpful getting all that I need to be able to do the work. In my family, I am the first to attain this level of education, that is PhD. And that is why I'm keeping this. <laughs> to show it to my children and to show it to my family members, the young ones that are coming up, that everything that you want to do in life, if you, you are determined and you want to work at it, you will get there. They can also do it. They can also climb higher and higher.